Good day everyone. My name is Teacher Nori. Today, we're going to learn the keyboard. Let's have first a review. This is the monitor. These are the letters, the numbers, and the symbols. And this is the keyboard. A keyboard is used to type letters, numbers, and symbols. A keyboard is also used to type commands and tell the computer what to do. A keyboard is organized as shown. It is composed of many parts. These are the parts of the keyboard. The number keys, the function keys, the enter key, the numeric keypads, the enter key, the arrow keys, the other keys, letter keys, space bar, windows key, and modifier keys. The home keys are A, S, D, F for the left hand and J, K, L semicolon for the right hand. When typing, reach out for the letters but always return to the home keys. The letter keys are used to type letters. Letter keys have the top keys, the home keys, and the bottom keys. The number keys and numeric keypad are used to type numbers. Next are the special keys. First is the backspace. This is used to erase the text you have typed. Next is the enter key. This is used to go to the next line and also used to enter a command or instruction. The third one are the arrow keys. This is used to move up, down, right, and left. The fourth one is the tab key. This is a short term for tabulator key or tabular key. This is used to take or move the cursor to the next tab stop. The fifth one is the caps lock key. This is used to type capital letters. Next is the space bar. This is used to make a blank space when you are typing. For activity 1, add the objects and box the number of the correct answer on the number keys. For activity 2, box the first and last letter on the letter keys of the name of the object in the picture. 